Women, the story of Babel is this. It is meat. It is in humanity. This is the story of Babel. You are the Babel. Tombstones. You know? Tombstones. You become Babel. You see the the Babel, the color. The color of Babel is like Edom. Edom as its characteristic of the you being and was made on fires. But you were unfinished. You were sent after the fires. You were sent. You didn't go to, you went to my, uh, my land. But when you get there, spirits speak to you things that they should not speak because you have not done anything, work, you know? This spirit that speaks to you are those ones, Babels. Babels is you called tombs, you know, tombs, T-O-M-B-S. As you have been reading the word of God, that you're not supposed to read it because it's cursed. You know, you must. You are the Babel that are supposed to work, but you did not finish it. You get that, you must. You did not finish your work because you've been calling me and calling me and calling me, Lord, by preaching the word of God. You know, by preaching the word, you become a bell of yourselves, tombstones. That's where you go. Every time you speak, that's where your spirit go. As I said, no one goes here and there without knowing things. You know? You learn something because of your spirits that was here and there. Here and there means in your body like your feet. I cut your feet. I cut your feet. And you may say that in your, uh, you are full, but your spirit doesn't have it, humans. This is to the symbol of, I'll cut your parts and throw it into fire when it's seen. Like when you kick a dog, when you kick a bird, or, you know, humans, your spirit is being cut and thrown off to fire. You may say it in there, but it isn't, humans. I am whole, you know, I'm whole, but many of you are not. One part of you are somewhere else, because you yourself is an I. An I, humans. An I means a soul in every part of you. It can't move without a sense. And that is you are a Babel, yourselves. Because once you, like uh, this, humans, you are a Babel yourself. You have feet, you have eyes, you have, uh, you have uh, legs. You can see it, it's all there, part, in your form. But spiritually, humans, you don't. This is why I say I'm an eye, stigmat. You called eye, stigmata. Stigmata means, in Philippines, means eye. It's a symbol too of atom, the eye of the wind, the eye of the NASA, the eye of everything. You understand, you must? The eye. You know, I'm the dog that does the works. You are the Babel that hasn't finished the work and you come to the world and, and in this end I've come. To give you the last test. To get things right. But yet, you calls me Lord. When I'm in front of you, you won't know me. Because 
I keep telling you I'm the Holy Spirit. I'm the Lord. You still don't accept that I am. You know, you must. Because you think that uh, the Lord you knew is uh, a man. Women, it's written in your book that when I said, when the body lifted up, you'll know I am he. Meaning to say, when the body was left, it was him. You understand, humans? You are the children I'm schooling and I'm teaching these things. It's still written in your book. A symbol of Father have test me after the 40 days I have prayed on the top of the mountains. When I came down, this is the word I have speak. It's all written in your book. You still do not know this. Reverse donut, I'm coming. You know, you must. When I say donut, it's my dog that misses me so much. You know, you must. My dogs that misses me so much that I left for this to you to open up. Is my Christ. You know, you must. Wherever I go, they're always with me. In this end. They're missing me. So I, for you to be saved, for you to wake up as you were the unfinished Babel that keep calling me and calling me and calling me, for you to be formed into a whole. Because what you see in your form, what I see behind you, you call curtains, is you are not but a bubble that unfinished, without head, a scratch on the face, without feet, cut on the heads, without ears, cut on the neck. You are, you know, Imas, this is what you are. You yourselves is unfinished bubble. It's written in all your book, everything I say, but you don't get it. Because if you don't read everything, you won't, you won't uh, remember all this. Because you only read one sentence, praises, which is to me, every praise, every sentence, every words is connected to what it was written. You are the unfinished, unfinished Babels, humans. You know, the unfinished Babels, that... I've cast every part in the fire. You know? Like a, a pork. A pork. You know, you must. I have cast uh, one part of you in this. But you, you must, you're not a pork. Not even. You're just bubbles. Every time you call me, I cut part of you. That is the meaning of the Holy Spirit can take anything. Because of you keep calling me, yet you do not know me. Because you think the Lord you knew is the GSUS. And then I was the GSUS in the, you know, in the Christ. In the Christ, but when the, but the body lifted, it was He. You know, you must, this is when I said, when the body lifted, you knew I am He. But in this end, humans, my body left, then it was my GSUS. As when I have, when He resurrects me, He says, Love, come, get up. You have a battle to go to. I could not leave humans because I can't and does not want to go anywhere without those I have loved. Took me a few years before I came here to do this. Took me a month and years. Even so, I have screamed. I will miss those I love. But in this end humans, I'm learning. 
that in the end I will see them, I will take them with me in the capturations. When he comes, I'll take those I have loved. You know, Yamans, this is a burden deep in my heart that every day I'm missing my dogs, you called gods. For you, that so that the fulfillment of the scriptures will be fulfilled, just like when it says, You are the children's, the Lord will teach the children. You are the children's. I am teaching all this. Because humans in heaven, children's means heavy. Heavy humans. There's lots of meaning to that depending on the place and time and dimensions where you are at right now. Because some of, me, some of you are still uh, have your legs cut in spirit realms, humans. This is what you are, you know. Have a legs part somewhere and then your spirit are not whole. That is what you are, humans. Like those who feel sickness, their parts are not with them. If they have sickness on the knees, the part of them is not with them. Because the spirit of their parts is somewhere else working to find its mates. You know, humans? Don't think because you can see your part, it's all there. It, this is the, the... You take things literally when in the beginning it's all illusions, not real what you see. Because what I see is a spirit. I am the Holy Spirit. That keep telling you this. You know, you must. And many is going to perish. I'm teaching you all this for you to wake up. For you to be prepared. You know, because you are the unfinished Babel. Unfinished Babel means a building that hasn't been finished. Like I just explained to you why. That is you. Unfinished because every part of you are one to the other. You know, spirit. This is why you become zombies.